Today, my kiddos and I are gonna make spaghetti squash marinara. Cooking healthy can be easy, it can be fun, and it can be delicious. Spaghetti marinara is one of my favorite meals. I have been to Italy several times and quite honestly, I ate spaghetti marinara almost every meal. And what kid doesn't like spaghetti? But traditional spaghetti is really not that healthy. It's got that wheat pasta that has lots of gluten and really it doesn't have micronutrients. It's not really increasing your health. So what I'd like to do is make a healthier version of spaghetti marinara. So enter spaghetti squash. Spaghetti squash is super healthy. And you know what? It substitutes for pasta really well. In fact, I switched out my kids' traditional spaghetti for spaghetti squash marinara, and they didn't know the difference. They loved it. They thought it was delicious. This is also a great meal to get the kids involved. And I'll show you in just a minute, I'm actually gonna have the kids do the spaghettiing. So spaghetti squash, it's got a really tough rind. And in order to get to the spaghetti, you've gotta get through the rind. And I really don't like having to put a lot of pressure on a sharp knife. You know, you're just, you're just asking for accidents. So what I like to do is cook the spaghetti squash about part way and then take it out and it slices so much easier. So first thing I'm gonna do is throw this in the oven. All right, this is looking good and it is definitely gonna be a little bit warm right now. It's not cooked all the way through. So definitely wanna, <laughs> use something, a hot mitt, a towel, something like that. But the rind is gonna be so much softer now. So what I'm gonna do first is cut through the stem end. All right, and that's gonna give me a nice flat surface to work with. And then I am just going to cut All right, and now we're just going to scoop out those seeds and get it ready to cook the rest of the way. One thing I like about this method is if you were going to cook it all the way and then scoop out the seeds, the spaghetti strands would be coming, coming apart and it's harder to just get the seeds out. So this is a really nice method to just be able to get the seeds out really easily um, and then spaghetti it later a lot easier. So we got the seeds all taken out. Just gonna coat it with salt and pepper and then put it on the cookie sheet. So some nice kosher salt and fresh cracked pepper. Now we are going to add some more salt and pepper later when we're um, doing it in the pan, but we want to have tons of flavor. So adding um, a good about it, Salt now is really gonna be helpful. All right, all set. Let's go throw this back in the oven. These spaghetti squash are all done. I'm just gonna let them cool and then I'm gonna let my kiddos do all the spaghettiing. My little munchkins are gonna come and, and do the spaghetti. All right, come over here. All right, so I've got these spaghetti squash that are all cooled. And you guys get to do some spaghetti. Okay, so get your forks. You gonna do it? Remember how we do it? Good job, Ella. Yep, we pull it from the outside and scrape it and get all that biscotti. 
So I think it is so important to have your kids help and interact with healthy food. And, and do this when you want to make pescetti. You do that when you make pescetti. <laughs> oh my gosh, look at all that yummy pescetti. Good job. All right, I think we did it. You ready? Oh, we gotta scoop it out. Oh, you did such a good job. I got no other kitty. You did get all I did a much for Ella. Oh, you made it for Ella? That's so nice. Um, if that were mine, yes, I made it just for you. Okay. I, I made it. You made it for the movie. You made it for the movie. All right, let's scrape all that out. Good job. All right, that looks great, guys. Thank you. Are you guys about ready for dinner? Should we have some sketty for dinner? Would that be good? Don't you guys go play? Now my kiddos have done all the spaghettiing and it's time to make the spaghetti squash marinara. So I'm gonna head over to the stove and we are going to coat all these spaghetti strands in flavor. We're gonna add some more salt, pepper, and just coat it in all this healthy fat um, and bring out so much amazing flavor. We're just going to coat the spaghetti squash in flavor. And so that is going to be butter or G and some olive oil and then some salt and pepper. So I'm going to be getting all that, that butter and G all melting. And then I'm going to add a good amount of olive oil. And we are just going to coat this in flavor. All right, and I'm going to add some salt and pepper. We've already added salt and pepper once. We want to make sure that this has a lot of delicious flavor. All right, and how do you tell when it's done? You try some. Mm. All right, and now I'm gonna add some of this delicious sauce. This is actually a homemade marinara. but you can use store-bought. Just make sure you look for some sauce that doesn't have any added sugar. Oh, that looks delicious. Oh, it smells so good. All right, all done. This spaghetti squash marinara is all done now. Let's get this on the plate. Oh, this looks delicious. It smells so wonderful. And I am going to add some fresh basil. and some diced cherry tomatoes. My kiddos love cherry tomatoes. That looks wonderful. My kiddos are gonna love it. So this is the spaghetti squash marinara. I hope your family loves it as much as mine.
If you enjoyed this video, be sure to click like and subscribe to my channel so you don't miss out on any new videos. Also, check out the video notes for the link to the recipe.